They've combined for 51 yards on the drive. Tucker will try and finish it off and he does. Touchdown Syracuse. Hartman on second down, deep down the middle, has a man open at the five, and the catch is made, the spin towards the goal line, and in for A.T. Perry. Wax took the top off of Zach Tom, that was the penalty. Yeah, he took the top off of Zach Tom, and then number nine, A.T. Perry took the top off the defense. He gets right behind Justin, Jason Simmons. Trader calls his own number, gets a push from his backfield, and in for the score. There's two. On, a, on assist from the fullback <laughs> slash tight end slash defensive lineman, offensive lineman, number five, Chris Elmore. Yeah, Elmore does a little bit of everything, but it, it was third. And now we have third down. I keep the ball in my quarterback's hands, Sam Hartman. They do. And he gets the edge for the touchdown. They're at the Dome in Syracuse, 21-20. Syracuse with the lead, but Wake looking to take it away. Perry with the catch, inside the five. Touchdown, Damon Deacons, as he juked Garrett Williams. To the last drive for Wake Forest. They had an opportunity, one-on-one -on -one with Perry on the outside on the third down. And remember, Hartman was sacked. They saw that. They came back to the same play. And instead of running the longest pass play of the day, and Syracuse looking to strike back. Tucker makes a man miss at the orange. With a big risk. Hartman gives it to Beal Smith. The cutback inside the five to the goal line. And touchdown. They'll get Hartman on the move again. Throw it to the back of the end zone. Roberson got it. Hey. Raider. Drops it off to Tucker. He's got good pressure. Got the shot. Tucker takes that. Syracuse. Try and take the lead. Pressure coming. Hartman to the end zone. And it is caught for the touchdown. And Wake Forest walks it off. That's a touchdown. That's a touchdown by A.T. Perry. His third touchdown of the day. Three catches. All of his catches have been touchdowns.